So we're at the entrance to the uh, West Bay Jetty campsite. Um, there's numerous different campsites along here. Uh, and you can see the uh, map there shows you where all the facilities are. Kerr Bay Campsite's the only one that's uh, open right through the year. Um, you can book Kerr Bay Campsite and this campsite um, from December through to the about halfway through uh, April. And then this one closes down and uh, Kerr Bay is uh, first come first served. Um, there's multiple different zones uh, to this park. Um, they've got a total of I think it's like 70 camping sites here and so you can see the kind of standard of them uh, over there uh, big flat areas with uh, gravel down so they're good for caravans and uh, camper vans there's some picnic tables um, here's another site just over here so you know you can see nice and flat um, not ideal for tents but you could set a tent up there um, you just have to think about how you set it up so that's one of the sites um, you can see you've got plenty of space there you could absolutely get a camper van in there you could even get a, a really long wheelbase uh, camper van and also your vehicle in there uh, sorry caravan and your vehicle um, they're relatively protected by these manuka trees around here. Um, it is windy down at this end of the lake because the wind is funneled down um, Lake Ratawishi right down to this end. So the um, campsites have these ablution blocks so they have cold water showers and toilets. Um, they don't have like cook shelters because you know you're kind of expecting the kind of people that would be here would be people in caravans, people in um, camper vans and so they've got their own um, cooking and like sleeping um, gear in the vans with them. The uh, buildings are closed over the winter time, they're only really open during the summer so they normally open them up um, at the beginning of December and they stay open through to uh, April and then Kerr Bay is the only campsite you can stay out up here at um, Nelson Lakes National Park after that time. Yeah. Water taps on the outside of the building, um, they're actually uh, locked off at this time. Um, they only open them up in summertime. So uh, this is the cold water showers. They're all locked at the moment so I can't show you inside. Um, and then the toilets are on the other side. You can see there's a, a sink there for water. Uh, water is uh, to a tank off the top of the roof. Uh, the toilets here at the West Bay uh, campsite, uh, like I said, they're all locked up at this time of the year. Um, they're uh, dual sex, so um, females and males, um, three of them. And then there's um, little uh, toilet blocks like this scattered all over the campsite. There's like about seven or eight of them down here, so there's actually quite a few facilities. Uh, sink over there for you to wash your hands with. There's a water tap there for you to load up your water tanks on your camper vans and your caravans. Uh, there's multiple of those scattered all over here as well. The water will have to be uh, potable, like you should be able to stick it into your tank without uh, treating it. Um, they probably have a treatment plant around here somewhere that supplies all the uh, taps and the toilets and uh, showers as well. That's one of the other camping areas uh, going down. You can see they're all the same. Uh, flat areas, um, taps down at the end there I can see. Uh, picnic tables and all protected within this manuka. There's an 0800 number there for um, the Department of Conservation.
So that's the uh, Mount Robert Road heading up to the car park for the Mount Robert Track. And uh, that car park you can see over there is for uh, the West Bay boat ramp. That's West Bay, uh, Nelson Lakes National Park. There's a boat ramp over there. She's right up out of the water at the moment, so the level of the lake is quite low.